guys and welcome back for some more Animal Crossing. Now today, I had no idea what I wanted to do for a video, but I accidentally stumbled across a way to make very fast, easy bells in Animal Crossing that you wouldn't expect. It doesn't require any internet connection at all, so you can do it if you don't uh, have the subscription for Nintendo Online. And I think you guys will be actually surprised on how I do this. This is actually kind of crazy that I haven't thought about it before. But yeah, if you end up liking this video, hit that like button. Let me know that you want to see more videos like this. And if you're new here, definitely hit that subscribe button. I will see you in the video. Hello there, everyone. Wow, look at that. Uh, hmm, there really isn't any news to speak of today. Really, Isabel? Uh, I looked up my horoscope for the day and it said I'm going to have good luck. Um, here's some news of my own because Isabel has none. So as you guys know, um, the Animal Crossing Twitter page has been talking a lot about, you know, having the fall leaves come. If you're really wondering like when that's going to be and why you can't get fall leaves yet, it's kind of like spring where it's only going to be available for 10 days, which sucks, but it's going to be available November 16th to November 26th. So if you want a time skip to that time, that would be the time that you would want to try to get all DIYs. I don't know if it's like the weather that is here today because it's kind of like dusk. Oh, this is such a pretty weather. Um, but my ground looks more orange. I'm pretty sure like my ground is actually more orange. Maple, are you getting all like Valentine's feeling? That's a really cute dress to wear for Valentine's Day. Yo, can I buy that? Please don't tell me my, my pockets are full. Okay, yeah. And then this would be really cute. Oh, maybe I should get like a tuxedo jacket. I'm going to buy that so that my me and my boyfriend can wear this on Valentine's Day. Mm, it's going to be so cute. So actually, I recently found out that this person has an Instagram. Uh, so I will link you to their Instagram here and also in the description if you want to check them out. I think they have really cool stuff. I love the way they they do things. So this is their plaid collection. These four here and then these four here also in different variations. Quirky, which is the marigold, sage and beige palette, which is this quirky plaid overalls. And then we have this quirky plaid coat. I love these. I love like how one side is one and the other one's this one. It's kind of like giving me abstract modern art. And then they also have casual, which is the white green this kind of one. So this is the casual plaid jacket, very much, very versatile. And this is the casual plaid overall. I love how you can tell like it's distress. <gasps> oh my God, that's genius. I can't wait till they like let us design pants because then distressed jeans are gonna be the thing. And this is the preppy collection. This is beige and different shades of blue, which I really like. Like this right here would be my cup of tea in real life. So I think I might save this one plaid preppy blazer i like how they give you different options i feel like not enough people do shirts or sweaters i feel like there's it's mostly just dresses because it's the biggest palette um and then they also have the sweet version which is cream and brown which i think is so cute so this is the sweet plaid vest and then they also have this sweet plaid dress sweet plaid vest sweet plaid dress so cute confirm She's so cute. <laughs> I look like a little um, modern business lady, but like a modern business kid. I don't know. I don't know why I feel so juvenile in this outfit. For today, I am going to try selling a bunch of my stuff because I am full. My storage is completely full. I feel really weird though, giving away like actual items because I feel like I don't appreciate the items that I have, like all this. You know, I, I'm probably not going to use most of it, but I, I feel like someone else will. So maybe I'll do like a giveaway or something. Oh, look at all my spooky lanterns. Okay, clothes. Hmm. Here comes the issue. I don't really wear a lot of clothes, but I can't I can't justify getting rid of iconic clothes like the Bug Aloha shirt and like the Coral Nook Ink Aloha shirt and the Dal Tee because those are like limited items. I can get rid of this dress shirt though. They're not just like regular clothes, like these denim cutoffs I could get rid of. Acid wash jeans. Uh, winter solstice sweater I'm keeping because that is so cute. Oh, see, look, I, I'm already having issues. But then here comes the issue is that all of my things that I have for clothes are somehow themed. Like I don't really waste any spots. Um, I'm gonna get rid of this dandy hat. Uh, let me get rid of the pink bunny ears. My pockets are full. Mm. That was so fast. <laughs> I feel like my goal, my goal is to be like, <laughs> I have so much stuff. Like I'm probably going to get like a million bells worth of thing. <gasps> oh my gosh. <gasps> Look at this. What's the, I want this. Oh, system kitchen. How much is that? 
Oh, 130,000 bells? I cannot buy it, but I think that that might be my goal. My, my goal might be 130,000. <gasps> I want to sell. Of course, get rid of everything. My guy, I want that. I'm not even clicking anything. What the heck? How much is that? It's going to be like 5,000, not even. Oh, 19. Yeah, that's pretty good. It's probably, honestly, like the mushrooms totally carried that cell. Uh, that's fine. Thank you. They were just like, there's a portion that I can't take, but I can like get rid of it if you want. I'm like, yes, please. I have been carrying these bushes for decades. I don't want them anymore. And I don't want to put them anywhere. Oh my God. Uh, if you know Christmas, buy all of the holly. Buy all of it. Oh, holly trees are going to look so nice. Oh, and they're going to look even better on snow. Oh, it's going to be like red, green, and white. Oh, it's going to look so good. Okay, I feel, I feel so bad because I always have like grand ideas and then I never actually get it done. I get like halfway there and then I run out of time. So maybe I'm just going to be like, I'll grab a couple things of holly. I'm not going to have like large expectations. Usually that's how I work is if I don't have big expectations for myself, I'll actually do like a lot more than planned. But if I do have big expectations, I won't. For some reason, I just work like that. So move to pockets, move to pockets. Move to pockets. Move to pockets. It's just gonna be this for the rest of the day. Actually, I should probably grab uh, mushrooms if I have any. Because those would be worth quite some money. And not the acorns because they're actually hard to get. Uh, I will grab some of these fruits. Whatever I can because that would be worth some good coin. Uh, summer shells, I'll keep cowries. I'll get rid of some of these shells that I have. I have way too many pumpkins. I feel like what I'm going to be trying to do this video is like just sell as much as I possibly can to like afford that kitchen, that system kitchen. <gasps> oh, how would I, I won't want to even do with the system kitchen, honestly, like probably nothing, but it'll be nice. But we have a couple of those and maybe some shells are rare and we have another elegant mushroom. So that's at least 10,000 guaranteed. So I'm going to estimate probably around 20, 20,000, 20,000, 20,000. 20,000 is my is my guess. Oh, 75,000. Uh, there were some bugs in there that really helped me out. Sorry to Flick. I'm just going to sell it to these guys. Sometimes I do try to wait for Flick, but my storage is full and I don't have any time to spare. So sorry, Flick. It's going to the boys. Oh my God. I didn't know I was such a wasp queen. Wow. Work. Actually, I might save three of them uh, just for Flick so he can give me one. That would be nice. Yeah, whatever I have three of, I think I'll save so that I can give it to Flick. And he can make me a couple statues. Oh, I really do need to like dedicate like more time to Flick and CJ. I feel like I ignore them so hard. Hey, it's Marina. What's up, girl? You also, hey, get out of there. That is my system kitchen. Get out of there. I see you. All right, I'm guessing we have a couple banded dragonflies, three Queen Alexandra's bird wings. Oh, but I feel like a lot of these are basic. I'm going to say 50, 50, but maybe on the lower side. Hey, that wasn't too bad. That was actually pretty close. Oh my God. I can't believe I did that. 198,000 bells right now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to buy this system kitchen because I can. I can just flex like that. Yeah, my upstairs, I have like a little bit of a kitchen. It's also my room. So I'm going to be putting my system kitchen in there. You know, upgrades, people, upgrades. Oh, yeah, I forgot it's also a music area. That's fun. So, yeah, this is my little kitchen. So cute. Now that I think about it. Oh, yeah, I'm just going to get rid of this. I don't know why it was in the middle of a room like that. Here, I will put my... Actually, wait. Is there like a little space right here? <gasps> I can put it right here. Oh, there is no stopping me. Here, let me place my system kitchen right here. Ah, it is so cute. Look at it. And I can get rid of this weird oven because like I have an oven right here. Cute. Get rid of this. I love that. I love my room. I love coming here. Super fast way to make easy bells that you probably already have. You just don't know how to, or you just don't know that you have it. Um, and yeah, it's going to be it for me. Uh, I will see you and my system kitchen in the next video. Bye.